Hey, what's up, everyone? Hi, how's it going? Been, uh, what, a few days already? Uh, I really appreciate, uh, the support that I've actually been getting, uh, and everything's been going real great. So, I wanted to start off, uh, letting people know I finally got Mario Kart 8. I, uh, fell to the peer pressure. <laughs> um, so I'm planning on maybe sometime next week actually setting up a whole day for Mario Kart races for whoever wants to join. Uh, that might be hopefully, uh, I'm assuming Friday would probably be the best bet for that. Cause I'll probably, I'm not sure how far I'm going to get on Pokemon today. So I want to see if I can finish it before I switch it up to Mario Kart. Um, besides that, uh, ever since the last stream, I tried leveling up a bit. I didn't do too much though. I brought my team up to uh t-pain went up a level and everyone else went up about one or two um besides that everything is pretty much the same i haven't done too much besides that because i'm not sure if there's any events that might trigger if i go deeper into the city right so i just went back and screwed around a bit but besides that right um everything seemed pr pretty decent Yeah, so I'm going to hope that everything is fine, and hopefully we, we get this going. So, last I remember, uh, there was a huge explosion, and basically, basically there were some rogue Dynamax Pokemon roaming around. And because of that, uh, the champion, Leon, just uh, had to come in and basically save the day, right? So, I thought we were going to end up helping him, but apparently not, because he's telling us to just focus on the gym challenge. Which, if that's the case, then sure, why not, right? I mean, he is a champion, so he should be theoretically the strongest trainer here. There's absolutely no point for you to have a 10-year-old come in and, you know, save the world. Well, speaking about events, right? Over here. Well, if it is at reach. I'd expect nothing less from you and your Charizard, Leon. You took down... Well, I am the unbeatable champion, after all. But what all is going on here? An overflowing red light. Pokemon Dynamax seem to have a power spot. Yeah, but why? Well, I'm not sure what's going on. The red light could suddenly appear again at any time, and we'd have no way of knowing. But being able to predict such a thing is part of a scientist's work. Gran? The chairman called for me. He wanted to know all about the red light's relationship to the Dynamax phenomenon. Did the chairman know anything? Nothing worth, uh, uh, nothing worth my time. The chairman's all wrapped up in fretting over the future of our energy, apparently. He's left everything to that executive. That's why I wanted to ask you to start looking into things too, Sonia. You know, more than anyone about the darkest day after all. Are you saying that the red light and the darkest day are connected? Hey, do you reckon there's anything we could do to help out? I mean, there should be. Thanks, I appreciate the thought. But all I could ever ask for is... Okay, sorry. All I could ever ask of you would be that you join me in the greatest final match ever. I'll do my part to make sure that happened by keeping by everyone's future safe. So you just keep on doing your part by winning your way through the gym challenge. Right, of course. You're the unbeatable champion after all, eh? Grand, there's something I want to look into. You'll help me, right? Naturally. Looks like we all know what... 
so we can meet again at the Champion Club. I know what I need to do, alright? Defeat the peers once and for all. You're off to Hammerlock Stadium, right? Uh, Ryan's a tough nut to crack. Okay, so I'm assuming that that's straight up ahead. My team should be good. Actually, it was a dragon uh, gem, right? So... Oh, you know that yeah, cool. Um, so yeah, actually, I normally I just record with one light. I have a LED in front of me. Um, but today I decided to have the, both the LED and uh the normal light on to make things a little bit brighter. Um, is it okay? <laughs> I mean, I'm assuming since you're making the joke, right? <laughs> Actually, let me see if there's anyone else here that might provide an advantage, because if that's the case, I might bring them along, give them some XP while they can, and... Why the hell am I healing my Pokemon? Ugh, oh, it's a habit. Oh, now you can see the, the, the poster. Yeah, um, it's actually a Monster Hunter poster. Um, Monster Hunter 4 for the 3DS. I ended up getting it at a local Ma and Pa video game shop over here. And they were selling it for like 10 bucks. It's actually like a scroll. Right? It's not even uh, an actual like poster poster. Let's see if I get anything out of the lottery. Nope. Tough shit. Well. Actually, I was told, wait, last stream that this one becomes fairy, right? So, I think my best bet would probably be bring him in. See, like, make him get some XP while screwing around. Uh, with the average gym battles, he might go up about maybe a few four or five levels. I guess that's fine. Oh, you don't have any held items. Actually, that's perfect. It's third evolution. Got you. F forty two. I don't think it I don't, I don't think it's going to reach 42 by the time I get to the end but hopefully it has maybe an attack or two that might help Actually by that logic right I should have probably kept the gallet because if anything Yeah gallet would have been a tank for for damage I I probably should have just kept them Oh hey anxiety, how's it going? Haven't seen you around in a bit. So you've you've missed out on a lot, man. Uh actually now I'm supposed to be going to the eighth gym. <laughs> and we were also doing um some smash lobbies, uh usually after every uh few hours of Pokemon. But hey, how have you been? What you been up to? You can still change it. All right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me. Thank you for reminding me. Um, I'll probably switch him up before the final battle, right? I'm going to see how much XP he ends up getting from this. Hopefully it's enough to even the odds a bit. Um, I'll also keep in T-Pain for a bit. Because actually, no, you know what? I'm going to switch him out. Uh, actually, I'll put Tito in. F Tito get some XP. Uh, put it back in your bag. 
I keep forgetting that that you can switch Pokemon on the fly. It's you know it it, it wasn't a thing back in the day, so it, it's something I'm definitely not used to. Oh wait, shit! I also forgot. I also have um. I know this might not be the best alternative, but where are you? Here we go. Let's see how much XP it gives me. 4,000. Not bad. That's a solid, solid level and a half. Okay. Uh, XP medium. Then went up a level. Okay. More than good. Perfectly fine. Uh, I don't think there's anything else. No, I don't see anything else that could increase its level. But we're gonna keep it like that for now. The uniform you wear is a symbol of all your victories. I feel your determination. Now head to where all the gym trainers await. No, not the stadium, but the vault. Okay, so they send me backwards. I'm assuming this is supposed to be its loading screen, but holy shit, is it taking a bit? Let's see, how many gym challengers are left? Huh, not even 10, huh? Alright then. Reach, time to explain the great Ryan Jim's mission. The rules are simple. All you've got to do is defeat three gym trainers that I've personally trained in double battles. The gym challenge is meant to be, well, challenging, wouldn't you say? Naturally, there aren't too many gym challengers who can make it this far. And that's why I provide a format where you can... Uh, brilliant combinations you and your Pokemon should be capable of. That's probably more than enough out of me. Time for someone else to take the spotlight. Yeah, they. they I, I feel like they are. Come on, Sebastian. You'll be the first. Yeah, that's me, Sebastian. Leader Ryan has taught me two things. First, dragon types are ferociously powerful. And second, I need to create an advantage on the battlefield to fully utilize that power. Okay. Um, yeah, you're up. Oh, I feel that the same thing. Like, gym, gym challenges here. Leaders, uh... Yeah, they're definitely a lot more childish. Uh, the other ones were more straight to the point. It was either a lesson, like, and I quote with, uh, it was a lesson for like, I guess, gameplay choices and mechanics. And uh, before that, it was just simple battles. Um, now it's just simply, we don't know how to make our gyms super creative. So we're just gonna find a way to make them do something, right? What did Topsy Turvy do? All sets changing effects the target turn Topsy Turvy and become the opposite of what they were. Okay, then ah. Gonna try and eliminate Pelibur, because I don't want him using uh, flying type moves on my on T Pain, because that would actually be very detrimental to him. Considering he's pure fighting, yeah. Drill pack for Pelibur. Uh, I guess this is fine. If they both hit him, he should be able to die. I forgot Water Pulse can confuse you. Holy shit.
it's just one of those attacks that you don't think, right, is meant for that. Well, if Tito's about to die, that's a big problem. I don't have any full restores, right? No, I don't. I have a max potion, hyper potion, and super potion. Uh, I'll just heal you for now, and... I'm gonna toss another reversal to Sligo. I'm honestly hoping that Pelibur, that air slash, that's exactly what I wanted to open, uh, worry, uh, prevent. Oh, hey, Zabumufu. Hey, how's it going, man? Shit. Fuck. Um, what you been up to, man? Uh, I thought, uh, you know, I saw that you ended up following me and I was like, oh shit. He, you know. You know, uh, I just wanted to mention, right, since uh, I know you're a Smash player, uh, after I end up finishing with Pokemon here, which is in about maybe, what, two hours or so, uh, I'm actually going to open a, a lobby if you wanted to go in. It was just working today, and now you're going to hop on Destiny. Oh, shit, uh, you played Destiny? Cool. Uh, did the, the new expansion come out? I haven't played since um, the last season. The season that started around August when they put crossplay. That was the last one I did. I haven't played it ever since. Yeah, you started playing two months ago. The Neo DLC is out on the 22nd. Oh, okay. So, I, I thought I already missed it. Um, I've been meaning to hop back on and play for a bit, but I haven't had the chance. Especially with um things like work and then other, you know, personal things on the side. But... Um, I might actually hop on back for the DLC. Oh, um, well, I used to play on console, right? Uh, Xbox, back when it first released. I dropped off the game heavily because I didn't feel like there was much to do. Then I ended up getting back into it about a year ago. And... Now I do PC. Oh, it gives me the option in between. Perfect. So... <laughs> Let me revive T-Pain, because I feel like he was robbed. You fell off when you used to play the first one. You know, I, I actually loved part one. I... Put in a bit... Part one, right? Uh, Taken King was by far, in my eyes, the best Destiny overall experience. Rise of Iron just built on top of it. It wasn't as good as Taken King, but it was still pretty good. Oh, um, thanks for uh the compliment on the team. Oh, so she has a nine tails. Draw. I mean, hopefully, right? Uh, what was it? The the new expansion, the the witch. I, I forgot the full name. Uh, hopefully, it's just as hype as Taken King, though.
Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, man. How's it going? Nice. Move set will play. This is team. We can get someone to end for a special move set. No. Um. So. That's actually a tough one, uh, anxiety. Because. I usually try and min max, uh, move sets and shit. For example, type coverage. Uh, well, I have a flying steel, I have a fighting, electric poison, dark fairy, fire, and, well, I have him here because I want him to evolve into a fairy for this gym, which I doubt he's gonna do in Kempson. Also, uh, hey Tito, what's up? The Witch Queen is looking pretty dope. Maybe watch a couple traders unless you don't want spoilers. Um, I remember uh, the huge presentation they had a few months back, right? Where they ended up showing that the Witch Queen had, like, her own subset of Guardians. Like, evil Guardians. And that part kind of had me hype. Because, uh, if you have, like, a Guardian boss battle. Or if they give you the option to eventually have, like, w uh, Witch Guardians. Yeah, that would be fucking amazing. Yeah, Hive Guardians. And I mean, yeah, reversal should be enough to kill it. But I'm also curious, right? Because uh, they introduced what was it, stasis as an element from the darkness. So I'm curious as to if they let you as a player use Hive Guardians, if they'll bring in a new element with it, right? Because Arc, Void, and Solar are all light. Crisis is dark. Weapon, weapon crafting. Wait, that's the thing? Also, wait, what happened? How, how did how did they both get wiped? I wasn't looking at the game. <laughs> oh, well, shit. Uh, well, Grim Snarl and just... Okay, well, either way, you're eating shit because... What are you, Fire Dragon? Whatever. Poison jab you. Oh, so that's what ended up getting us both. That's what wiped my team. Now I get it. Okay, wait. And Sucker Punch can go first, right? And it will, yeah. If the enemy is targeting an attack. They're mostly reworking Void right now. I haven't heard of another new subclass yet, but you can craft custom weapons with perks. Uh. Also, I didn't mean to take your focus off. <laughs> No, 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 it's perfectly fine. It's perfectly fine, right? Um, I don't have that many people who I know of that play Destiny. So, you know, it's kind of nice to have someone to talk about it with. <laughs> also, I think I did something stupid. And hopefully, yeah, it is what it is. Um, But yeah, I, I've actually been, you know, I, I need someone to talk about it with. I have one friend who's into it. But he's usually so busy with work and shit that we don't have much time to, uh, like, do quests and stuff. And, you know, in all honesty, like, Destiny is one of those games where it's probably better if you have a squad. Can I heal? Okay, sorry. Can I heal before I fight you, though? Yes, I can. Perfect. Oh, these people are actually making me use my my items. <laughs> I'm gonna get so fucking toasted when I fight this dude later. I probably also should have stocked up on items. Oh, 
Oh, you'd be down to do quests? Actually, I might I might take you up on that offer. Um let, let me Let me see uh how far back my character is, cause I, I gotta put some work in, right? I could probably gotta do some quests and shit. And I'll hit you up. Uh actually I'm not sure if you uh do, but hop on in on the Discord and it's probably easier for me to message you through there. Right? Because uh, I'm not sure if you do Discord or voice chats, but, you know, I usually hop on, so it's probably easier that way. I'm not sure if uh, you do it, though. Oh, we're fighting Aria. Obama Snow and Hakamu. Hakamu is a uh, uh, a fighting dragon, right? Hmm. Actually, I think he might be. So I'm gonna toss uh, a flying move his way, just to fuck with him. And the other one's definitely an ice type, so fighting overpowers ice. Yep, one shot, one kill. Perfect. I feel bad for Warriors. He's only getting like a thousand XP. Made the opposing team stronger against physical attacks. Actually, that should be perfectly fine, right? Because either way, um... I mean, I know uh, T-Pain has pretty high defense overall, so his best... Wait, now that I think about it, actually, he might screw me over if he has, like, a nice beam or some bullshit like that. Uh, might want to actually finish this pretty fast. So, let me toss over power. Super effective. Nice, we avoided the attack. Well, actually, one of us did. Wait, is it not super effective because of his steel typing? I guess not. Okay, great. Also level 30. Dazzling Gleam. Yes, yes. I need more fairy moves. Uh, sure. If uh, you're okay with the anxiety, I don't mind. Actually... Do, do you want anything in exchange for these Pokemon that you're offering? Because I kind of feel bad that you're putting in the all that work, right? And I'm not giving anything back. You sure? Oh, hey, it, um, I really appreciate it, though. You beat the game and beat the Pokedex, so you're good. Okay, so... You actually filled it out completely. Is that with or without the DLC? Yes. You have the frog. Wait. What? Wait, the frog? You fill the DLC too. But wait, who the hell is the frog? Oh! Oh, oh, oh! You mean the depressed one? Yeah, the depressed Pokemon. Yeah, Sobble, him. I should probably heal up a bit. Do I have any berries? I have three citrus. Holy shit, wait. 25, okay. You nicknamed it so you didn't remember. You just saw your Discord. 
Oh, hey, no, no, um, no worries, uh, Zabumafu. Also, um, just in case, so I'm not sure if you play anything else, right? But if you do things like Rainbow Six Siege, if you do Halo Infinite, if you do Monster Hunter, um, toss a message in the gaming social. There's usually someone who'll hop in. So if you want anyone to play with, you know where to go. Let me hit save too, because I'm actually very fucking paranoid that I might not make it out of here. Also, Shira. You know... <laughs> um, may maybe, maybe you should nickname it in a way that it's, you know, more in tune with the type of Pokemon it is. Okay, and you aim to defeat Leon. Do you have any idea just how high a hurdle that is? As his greatest rival, I guess that I, Ryan, will have to show you. Gym leader Ryan doesn't simply control the weather. He also seeks two-on-two -two battles. You must be prepared for any situation against a foe like him. You call it Aoi, so its name is just blue. I mean, yeah, I know a little bit of Jap, so... <laughs> I know what Aoi is. Oh shit, dude has a fly gun. Wait, is there a trampage around? I have not seen one here. Also that 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 rough type is getting fucking blasted. Uh you're getting your ass beat by a Carbonite and Arceus. Is it more aggressive? Yes, sir in the wall area. Okay, so you're dragon flying, right? And you have you have levitate, so I cannot use. Uh, actually, no, you're not a flying type. You were dragon ground. I don't think steel moves are gonna do anything to you because of your dragon typing. So I might have to use dark. Actually, no, home claws doesn't. Fuck. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna hit you with something. In the meantime, our rock over here is gonna eat shit. Not very effective on Tiro. Although I have lower attack now, so that's not... Not very pog. Okay, so you... You are weak against it, but apparently it's not enough damage anyway. Was it because he lowered my attack? No, I don't think it would have done that much of a difference. So I legit have to take out this bastard first. Uh, Rock is weak to steel, right? So I should be fine with that. Thunder punch. Okay, yeah, that's still effective against me. <laughs> Okay. Oh, and it was a crit too. Fucking nice. Yo, Tito. Yeah, I know, right? You you really do become an in clutch, man. Hey, look at that. You're even 46, man. Grim Snarl was 47. That's perfectly fine. Tandaconda. Is it a dragon? No. I it has to be ground type though. Although that flygon is pissing me off and I want it gone. I want it gone now. So actually I should probably First I'm gonna heal you. I don't want you dying Tito. Wait, did I just fuck that up? 
I think I probably did. Because that was T-Pain's move, right? Yeah, I did fuck it up. Oh, of course, you have to paralyze Tito. Hmm. I'll probably hit you with another drill pack. And T Pain. You know, what? I'm gonna hope, right? That you don't get screwed up yet. And hopefully, you can tank one more turn if they go after you. Well, thank god I didn't attack him though. Thunder punch, no! Tito live. Thank you. He can't move. Fuck. I actually have to spend this turn uh, healing. Hyper. And we're hitting you with a hyper too. Actually, I gotta check. Um, do the swords already carry four, four swords? Yes, thank you. That sandstorm was annoying. Let us get you out of here. And... I'm gonna throw some hands. Not enough damage. Yeah, definitely not enough damage. Okay, so every time he takes damage, he kicks up a sandstorm. That is stupid. I'm risking this. Actually, no, we should be fine. Is that like the only move he uses? You want the Rowlet to be fully evolved? Uh, Rowlet was the starter, right? The little owl, the owl who evolves into the archer. I guess I could um, I could probably breed them and get the previous forms. What are you? What is your typing? I want to attack you from the get go, but I'm not sure if I should. Yeah, then uh, sure. I guess if uh, you're willing to put in the work, I'll take it. No problem. I appreciate it, man. Actually, no, my team is probably going to get fucking handed right now. My priority should be Sandaconda. Because of the snow, uh, Sandstorm and the fact that he's just a staller. True Pain's going to die anyway this turn, so let's just hit Superpower. Okay, sure, not a problem. Dynamax, buddy. <laughs> okay, so this is the tower that I that I've seen memes about. 
Dude is literally a building. He uses protect, of course he uses protect. Why wouldn't he use protect? Fucking A. That was right. Okay, so it it screws up with your power points as well. <laughs> Kinda fucking busted, but sure, not a problem. It's not smart. I I shouldn't. You know what, why not? At this point, I, I think it's probably just best to stall for his Dynamax. You can't protect twice, bro. Uh, Pyro Ball. Hopefully this is enough to kill you. I doubt it, but... It does enough damage, that's fine. Rock Fall is made for Birdie. No, actually it's for Razor Reds. Actually, yeah, I'm surprised he, he tanked it too. That's perfectly fine. So, Duraludon should probably be killed right about now. Uh, does Fire Pledge hit more than one enemy? No, it does not. Pyro Ball is only one, and Flame Charge is also one, right? Yep, it's also one. Hmm. I'll just toss Fire Pledge for the hell of it. Sandaconda is already dead anyway. If you don't hit Razor Reds. But you know what? Fine. Whatever. That's already your third turn. Your Dynamax should be done by now. So, Grim Snarl should be up top now. So now that he's out of the way, uh, he's, well, he is pretty fast, but I'm assuming that that's probably because of his Dynamax, right? So I'm gonna drill back Sanaconda, definitely Dynamax and Starfall. Wall of muscle, baby. Actually, that might kill him. Oh no! Yo, Tito really do become any clutch. Holy shit! What does this do? A mist, okay. I'm not gonna have Tito die on me. Oh fuck no, he, he's tanked too much. My boy's an OG. You deserve it, heal yourself man. This joint funny. Bro, Tito, you don't fucking die. Look at that, you're even avoiding attacks.
<laughs> yeah, you don't, you don't, you're, you're, you just hesitate, bro. You don't want to be killed. Also, you're level 47, so pretty fucking nice. I might have lost, but I still look good. Maybe I should snap a quick selfie. Yo, what the fuck, man? In the aftermath of the furious battle, I feel as pure and refreshed as when the sky clears after a storm. What could I possibly say? Calling myself Leon's rival? Seems I'd grown quite conceited for someone who can't even claim the title of champion. Overconfident in both myself and my team. I'll give you what you want then. The proof of your victory. The dragon badge. Fork it over, buddy. Fucking A, we got it. Oi, baby. You can now catch Pokemon of any level. Kiss my ass. You, you've collected all the Pokemon. Okay, you've collected all the gym badges from the Galar region. Now, win your way through the semifinals and finals for your chance to challenge Leon. You must. You owe us that much, at least, for beating us in battle here today. You're absolutely right, good sir. You've collected all the gym badges. At least it's time for the Champion Cup. Oh, sorry. At last, it's time for the Champion's Cup. I look forward to seeing how you all do in battle. Hey, Reach. Sorry to hold you up there, but there was something I forgot. First off, as a sign of my respect, here is TM99. It contains the move Breaking Swipe. Which I have never heard of. The user swings its tough tail wildly and attacks opposing Pokemon. It also lowers their attack stat. Oh wait, isn't that what he used earlier? Yeah, I think so. Secondly, there's a dragon type gym uniform, the mark of a true the mark of true strength. Number 117 for you nerds out there, that's actually um Master Chief's number, which is why I ended up using it. Um, challenge your reach. You've completed the gym challenge. Good on you, kid. Now prove your strength to the whole region at the Champion Cup. Ryan, I'm here just to see how good you are. There you are, Leon's little brother. Don't worry, I'll give you a battle that'll make you want to quit the gym, the gym challenge altogether. I've tried out a lot of different strategies, and I've made up my mind on how I want to battle. I'm not going to lose. And I'm going to beat you, Reach, and even Lee. I'll be seeing you reach. Let's have another epic battle someday. If you're freeing up to it, you might want to go train hard in the wild area. Found a seated prick. I'll go and train wherever the hell I want. Also, did I talk to you? Did you give me a Pokeball? Okay. Uh, Yeah, you did. Shame. Hey there. Uh, okay, actually, she, she was saying that too. Hey there, Reach. You gave Ryan a good thrashing, and that means you completed the gym challenge. Congratulations from the bottom of my heart. I really wish we could go celebrate, but I think there's some things we should talk over. The light that covered Hammerlock. It was just like the darkest day, where it's said that giant Pokemon went on a rampage and almost destroyed the entire Galar region. It certainly seems to be that way, my dear. As you know, we Dynamaxed our Pokemon today, using the energy from wishing stars that have fallen to us. But we still don't know how to fully control the energy behind Dynamaxing, or how the two heroes managed to do so. In fact, we're not really sure who or what the two heroes actually were. The Legendary My dearest, my lab coat... Are you sure, Gran? I haven't finished the work you've assigned me. Think of this as something to help you finish that work. Ayo, the glow up. Professor Sonia, absolutely. The two heroes that protected the Galar region from the darkest day. 
and the legend of the sword and shield you just mentioned. It's up to you to figure out the truth behind it all. I know, Gran. I'll do what I can. You or Hop could be the one that, uh, the one to take down Leon, and I don't want to miss that. But not to worry. Now you can count on me to take care of everything. You can just focus on getting to White Windon. Yeah, Windon. Go on. Head to the station, or you'll miss the train. You're not going to the station. First of all, I'm fucking healing. I'm not going anywhere with a ha like half-assed beaten team. I find it funny because literally Warriors is the only one that's out of fucking place. You see a whole team like literally made with big buff and or edgy Pokemon. And then you have this little piece of shit in the bottom. <laughs> okay, anxiety. I got you. Uh... Quick question, you mind if we end up setting that up for for after the stream? Or do you want to do it now to get it out of the way? Which is which is better for you? 98. Okay, got it. I, I really appreciate it. We're buying 20 of these. I need to have a shit ton. I feel like I'm 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 gonna need it. Also, I don't see the point. I mean Max HP, but I'll, I'll just take 150 because they're cheaper anyway. And while I'm at it, how many ultra? I have 38 Ultra Balls. I have absolutely surprising. Uh, I'll be taking some revives. Thank you. I'll take about 20 of those. And for the fuck of it, I mean, full heal is relatively cheap, right? So I'll take uh 20. I'm poor again. I'm only at 128k. Oh, the humanity. Is there anything I could sell? Actually, there's a few things I could sell. Sure, why the fuck not? Here we go. No rare bones. Ball mushroom. It can be sold at a high price. Don't have to tell me twice. Nuggets. Uh, I prefer eating my nuggets, but I guess I'm selling these. And big pearl, 4k. We're out. The for camping, right? So yeah, I'm gonna forget that. Uh, we're good here. We're good here. Yeah, we should be good overall. Also, is there anything that you have that might be interesting to me? Uh, we have 18 timers, two dusks. Is there a point behind the dive ball in this game? You don't even dive. Or catching wild Pokemon that live underwater. Is, is that like general? Like, general speak for water Pokemon in general? Or do they have to specifically be Pokemon that live underwater? Because if that's the case, there's absolutely no point. Either way, whatever. We're, we're on our way. Thank you, yes, yes. I have beat all eight gym leaders. Indulge me. Uh, I couldn't read what they had to say. Oh, I'm sorry, people. Wait up, Breach. I'm coming too. I had Ryan beat in no time. Once I got my head on straight and stopped doubting every decision I made, that is... <laughs> Prick. And you never stopped nattering on through the entire battle. You're pretty different from the champion in that. Bring a badge. You won from me. You came at me with all the force of a raging storm, and even I was blown away. Listen up, you two. Battle your way through the Champion Cup tournament to face Leon. One of you oughta. I reckon I'm still the favorite to win. But I'm up against my future rival, Reach. So I'll ring out every last thing I learned during my battle with you, Ryan. Just to be him. So, gonna move on. Hey, yo, we actually get to see the inside of a fucking train. Let's go. Wait, why does he have a blue one? That's not fair. I want a blue one. Actually, 
like the the setting from the the new one yeah man said so that's not fair bro i want a blue phone why do i why do i have to get the red one that's that's at least give me the goddamn choice right well why does he get the different colored one why do i get the same one that everyone else has it's not fair i'm gonna be the champion i'm the protagonist give me something defining still this is route 10 it's like a wall made out of snow Bet there, bet there will be ice type Pokemon crawling out of the woodwork in a place like this. Come on, Reach. Re reckon we'll be able to train ourselves up to new heights here before the Champion Cup starts? I believe in myself and the Pokemon on my team, and I know we'll all get stronger. Yeah, well, no shit, right? It's snowing. <laughs> How did you guess there would be ice Pokemon here? Oh, well, there's an item here. That's pretty good. Oh, great. Two X attacks. I don't even use them. <gasps> Is that fucking Mr. Mime? Is that fucking Mr. Mime? I want that shit. Come over here. <laughs> Yo, it is. Okay, I'm actually hyped for this. 45. Yeah, yeah, apparently this is the, Galar the Galarian re um, version variant. I don't know, wait, is, is he still psychic? Or does he have a different element? I mean, he looks like he might be an ice type, considering he has a fucking huge Chris on his chest. But then again, maybe I'm just stupid. How we're gonna find out. Ice and Psychic. Got you. No! I killed it! God damn it! It wasn't meant to be. Your sacrifice was not in vain, though. Warriors evolving. Yo, I wanted to catch it. I'll just get the next one that shows up. But... <laughs> God, yo, bro. Got you. You're still psychic. Not a problem. You want her in Brutal Swing. Wasn't Brutal Swing a, a dragon move? No, Dark. Uh, user swings his body violently. Okay. So, damage on everything in its vicinity. So, this is actually a, a wide range move. But, you see, here's the problem. Attack right now, right? That is a 60... Power move. 33 attack on this shit is an absolute waste. There's no reason for me to have a physical attack on this. Like, these are all ranged attacks. That uses a 68 base attack, uh, special attack, a lot more prominently. I'm not doing it. Besides, I have like four other dark types that are very fucking good. Hey yo, wait, you came back. And I got a revive too. So this time I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna do the stupid move of using a steel move. I'm just gonna use drill pack? And if he kills me, he kills me. But I'm catching this shit. You will be fucking mine. Where are you? Ultra, 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 ultra. Uh, yep, here we go, baby.
You stay in that goddamn ball. Thank you. It knows who it's smashing with. It knows I have authority. Boom burst. Is that a uh, electric move? No, it's normal. Uh, user attacks everything around it with the destructive power of a terrible explosive sound. Hmm. Well, well, actually, it's not bad. It is a ranged attack. Sure, it's normal, but it has 140 base power and 100 accuracy. My special attack is 133. I mean, my normal attack is just a few points under, so whatever. It, it doesn't matter what it is, but 140 with 100 accuracy is actually very good. Uh... I've hardly used Toxic. I've only used it as like a last resort when I know I can't do enough damage. So... I'll just get rid of this. Yes, thank you. You are Ice Psychic. Yo, it's Half Dances. Mr. <laughs> So, following the <laughs> the trend here, you're actually supposed to be named the real Gage. Oh, I I won't have enough space for it. Okay, so I have to I have to work with this. Wait. No, I screwed it up. Uh, uh, uh. I need to go back now. Uh, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center, town map. There is a Pokemon Center right here. Would you like to call a flying taxi? Yes. I need to switch this up. No, 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 I made that horrible mistake. Give me one second. I'll be right back with you. Uh, rate a nickname. Select. Let's get rid of this. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna see how I can try and fit this. The real... Gage. Do I have enough space? No, I don't. Okay, so... Uh, he is... Okay, so I'm gonna have to... Real. <laughs> I have to work with your name, bro. I'm sorry. I, it's the only way to make it all fit, right? This is the only way I'm able to fit your real name. No. So, should I switch back to Warriors and have it uh, level up? Or should I actually keep Gage? Because I don't think... Uh, Actually, I think it. Pro I, I should probably keep Gage because it's an Ice Psychic. I don't have that typing uh, coverage. Right? Because I want Warriors to be... Uh, what was it? A Psychic Fairy? Which... It's fine, right? Because Gage is Psychic already. So I already have that covered. I already have a Fairy with Grimmsnarl. Should I switch back or should I keep him there? Hmm. I'm I'm thinking about this. Uh, sh I'm not sure if I should keep leveling it up or, or if I should just keep Gage. What like what moves do you have? Wait, I'm genuinely curious now. Oh, I fucked that up. 
Uh, here we are. Summary. Wait, what the hell is freeze dry? It is a ranged 70. Super effective on... Oh, it's super effective on water types, too. That's... Interesting, actually. Error code. Retaliation move that counters any special attack. Inflicts double the damage taken. Hypnosis. And Sucker Punch. I might definitely switch out these two. Sucker Punch. The moment I get another dark move. Uh, preferably a, a, a ranged one. Wait. Let me check its stats. Uh, spe yeah, special attack is higher than base attack. So, uh, as soon as I get a ranged, uh, dark move, I'll probably switch it out. Hypnosis, I'm indecisive if I should have it. Uh, it might be a, a nice boon in battle. Hmm. Actually, no, I'll keep Gage for now. I'll keep Gage for now. If I... If the need arises where I need a secondary fairy, I'll pull out warriors again. Uh, do I just walk in over here? Yeah. Uh, Wedgehurst, Motostoke, Wall Area, White Hill? I guess it's this one? Yeah, it's White Hill. Perfect. No. And I gotta fight you. So, actually, I, I, I really want to try him out. Um, but considering this is a area where there's a lot of ice Pokemon, should I? Yeah, I'll, I'll just use T-Pain. Uh, give an item. There we are. Come at me, big sir. Do you have any injured Pokemon? I'm a doctor. That is a very unusual way to challenge someone to a battle. Like, you're asking me if I need healing, and then you literally attack me. This sounds like a, a, some JoJo protagonist level bullshit where it's like, oh yeah, my character can punch you and it somehow heals you. Not very effective, fuck. It's funny how the moment I think, oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of ice types around here. Let me switch up to a fighting type for a type advantage. I literally get a Pokemon who's strong against me. Fucking ridiculous, man. Yo, Tito, you're coming in clutch again. You're applying that pressure. Very. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> it's special attack, Rose. So I definitely have to finish this quick. Um. Also, wait. Gardevoir is fairy, right? Ever since uh. X and Y. So yeah, Steel Wing is super effective. Absolutely perfect. Oh, but it avoided the attack. You asshole. Oh, but perfect. Not very effective. Still did enough damage, though. Uh, I am hoping this literally kills you because I don't want Tito to go down. Tito has been... Yo, you... Mi Tito, what's wrong with you, huh? Huh? You were a goddamn boss earlier. Well, why are you suddenly nerfed? Yeah, I'm looking at you. You know, you know exactly what... Yeah, you. You. Why did you do this? Everything was fine. You were a god. Why were you so clutch earlier? Huh? And you let a goddamn Gardevoir take you out? You should feel ashamed. What does play rough do? It is a 90-90 physical. Uh, I have 123 physical attacks, so actually that's very good. Uh, spare break, lower special attack. That is perfectly fine because my special defense is high, makes me buff here. Um, 
more of a tank. Uh, I could get rid of nasty plot. Not necessary. Your clutch in needed moments. I'm sorry. So you're saying I didn't need you there? Bro. You had type advantage against a Gardevoir. How, how could you not be clutch? I'm disappointed in you. You... You seeped up my expectations so high just to fail me in the end. Not very poggers. He simped so much that he let the guard... Yo, Tito, since what... Yo, bro, since when you a simp, Tito? Oye, papi, eso no se hace. Yeah, I'm not fighting you. Yo, look at that. There's a shit ton of Mr. Rhymes here. You're on the phone. Don't turn around. Don't know what that like. What you talking about, big... Yo, no, 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 no. No, get out of here. Also, I want you. You can get into Max. What do you mean que yo no puedo hablar, papi? Yo no sin feo. Carajo te pasa a ti. You better not die. Thank you. Buff up your defense, because you know this might kill you. Hopefully it doesn't. Nice. Perfect. I can toss in. Oh, and that was a crit? Okay, so I can toss like maybe two more. Buff by the hill. If I do that, I might actually kill you, so I'm not gonna. Mm, uh, mm, mm, mm. Yeah, actually, yeah, I might, I might, I might. Also, Tito, mencioname una vez. Mention one time. Oof. That damage. Don't die. Thank you. Now, I only have, like, what? Three turns? Tops to catch him? So hopefully this Ultra Ball is the one and the only. <laughs> it's not. Cool. For you is known by the horny lord. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Wait, wait, wait. There is a huge difference between being horny and being a simp. Okay, those are two very different things. Oh, yo, it was a crit. Holy shit, perfect. You don't think that they're far, that far off? Well, good sir, I would actually argue that with you. They aren't. They are. They are, people. They are. You don't have to be a simp to be horny or vice versa, okay? A simp is basically... Además... No me culpe a mi culpa el pájaro ese que se dejó. Ese pájaro, that bird that you're talking shit about, has your name on it, good sir. Well, why, why are you attacking the poor bird? He has done absolutely nothing wrong. He just lost because he sent. If it was me, you would have one shot at that card boy. You know, I. Sure. I'm. I'm. I don't wanna. I don't wanna go down this rabbit hole right now. But sure, Tito. All I'm gonna say is, you know. You say that now because you're human. 
you're 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 looking at it from a human's perspective right versus a pokemon but what if you were also a pokemon right like who knows may maybe that pokemon was within your type you never know you're, you're you're looking at it from from a human perspective And also, it'd be a Metagross and one shot. <laughs> Yo, I wish, I wish there was a Metagross. Like, is there Metagross in this uh, region? Uh, Beldum, whichever of the forms, Metang even. I would love to find it. With the no simp line of vegan thought. Of course, of course you had to hurt yourself. Of course you did. Why wouldn't you? And is water pulse gonna kill you too? Are you gonna hit yourself? Thank you. Atta boy. You have one. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, is it fully evolved? Is it, what, like, what? Actually, um, if you can breed it and give me Beldum, I would actually appreciate that a lot more. Because I, I, I actually want to train it. Also, uh, what the hell did he say he was going to toss out? Uh, you know what? I, I don't remember. We're going to send out Gage. Noctowl. Okay, actually, this is fine. This is fine. He's a flying type. I can just toss freeze dry. I don't think you're gonna do much with that, buddy. Oh, you did more than I thought you would. Never mind. But this should kill you. Atta boy. Starting off good, Gage. Starting off good. Yo, Tito, 48. Let's go. I lost when I think about it. I didn't want it to ever end. Okay. Oh, bueno. Let me heal up Jess. I feel bad for him. You have to fix your mistakes earlier. Hey, Sneasel. Hi. You're very adamant about joining me, good sir. Also, hey, I haven't seen you around in a bit. Hi, Jess. How's it going? Actually, I was just talking about you. I was just talking about you. Um, You literally had to... You literally had to come in and and save my run here because someone else here decided to simp for a Gardevoir and your Pokemon ended up coming in clutch with your poison attacks, which thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, you ended up saving me. You said you Yes, you are clutch god. Thank you very much. But hey, um, how's it been? What you been up to? Did you beat the gym? Actually, yes. Um, I have already beat all eight gyms, and I am going upwards, good sir. I think all that's left is, uh... Yeah, I beat them all. Okay, so, um, last week I beat gyms 1 through 3, this week I beat on Tuesday, uh, 4 and 5, Wednesday I beat, and today I beat number 8. 
did you catch Zayshin? I, st I, I, I still haven't gotten to that part yet. I, I don't, I haven't fought him. I literally just beat the the eighth gem, and uh, well, the story hasn't progressed to that point. Yeah, gems, not the game. Go to the slumbering woods. Yeah, I I know I have to do that, but um, do I have to? But I'm not sure if I have to go now or if I have to go like afterwards. No, not yet. Not yet. I'm not a champion yet. I uh just like I like what like maybe 15 minutes ago or something like that. I ended up beating the the last gym. So yeah, you're you're not you're not that far off though. He paint is 54. That's nice. So you just gotta be a champion after that. Go to the woods, do the whole story with the sword and shield, guys. Um then you catch Zacian. Got you. Hopefully superpower is enough to one-shot it. It is not. Wow, that is very heartbreaking hopefully you don't kill me oh well t-pain is out big sad uh let's see here so you have you know what no uh i'm not gonna screw around with you that much you're You know, I'll actually, hmm. You know what? Gage is actually the weakest one right now at 47, so I'll probably just use him. Because the Pokemon that is out is one that gets most XP, right? So it should be fine. Freeze dry, freeze dry, freeze dry him. Thank you. Oh. Oh, okay, and it was super effective too. 48, that's good. He wants to learn Psychic, yes. Psychic, uh, should I... H Hypnosis is the first one that's gonna be gone. Uh, I would like to keep it for catching Pokemon, but... If anything, I can just give it to Slowpoke. Uh, are you... Uh... I do plan on getting Flapple so I can get the the other form uh because there was what one one form per game right I'm gonna see if I can get uh the second one because they're both grass grass dragon right and to me personally that's a very interesting yeah I have to go to shield to get it um, but I know I know people with shield, but they don't have um they don't have him. So it's just a a trade. So I give it to him and then he gives it back. It's easy though. Yeah, but it, you know it's people who don't really play as much as they used to. More busy with newer games like Arceus. SM, the yeah, Appleton, yeah, and y'all can trade. I could. I'm not sure if they're willing to put in the the time and effort though. I'm just wait. No, I don't. <laughs> Why did I hit restore? Actually, no. True Pain has the luck incense. You only have swords, so you can't help. That's perfectly fine. I, I really don't uh expect you guys uh to do it. Like you guys do it if you want, right? And I really appreciate it. But if you you know, I know you guys also have your own things to do. So I don't I, I really don't want to bother you guys too much with it. Hey, 
Can I pay Unite? Sometime in the future. Uh, I'm... I've been thinking about trying it out. Because... I've never actually played MOBA games before. Right, so... I'm curious about it. Since it's so free to play, might as well. But, um... I, I, I don't know, I'm also kind of... On the fence about Unite because at least from what I've seen it's very pay to win I'm not sure if um, they fixed it right from how it used to be early on when it released but I don't know man I I'm, 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 I'm curious but I'm not sure it's not pay to win really only for clothes and skin. Is it? Like, early on, I remember you could, um... Purchase... What was it? I, I know that there was something for... I think it was for XP or something like that. You haven't spent a single time to get... You be cooking people, como si Get some skins or clothes and... Be, yeah, speaking facts. Then, then, there was a controversy about it, though, back when it first released. Like, I'm pretty sure th there, there was a controversy about it. Also, what am I fighting? You're, I'm, I'm fighting the fighting type. Uh, here. Actually, not anymore. Well then, okay, not anymore. Then if that's the case, I, I, I might, um, I might try it out then. Uh, I mean, I'm only level 18, and I'd be destroying just about everyone with Serena's, Cinderus, Nine Tails, and P Pikachu. He just started two days ago. Yo, that's fair. You use Ninetales, Dragonite, and Snorlax. It just depends on the held items you put on your Pokemon. You upgrade those and you're chill. Aria. Okay. Um, and like, out of curiosity, how many playable Pokemon are there? Because I'm pretty sure they, they've added more, right? After launch. You mean Zeraora and Machamp, but you consider yourself good depending on the situation. Not that much. Not that many. Many, but they're adding. Okay. Right now they have 31. Recent addition was Age of Slash. Uh, okay, I'm stupid. I should have just kept them. Uh, you know what? No, we're, we're you know we're, we're doing this. Oh, half balance. It's fine, and it's tanky. I hope you don't have counter. Woke up. Okay, that's perfectly fine. He just slash is broken right now. So, um, actually, Tito. Uh, if you have a chance, right, do you think you could send me, like, uh, a list or something of the current playables? Yeah. Yeah, of the roster. Thank you. I'd appreciate it. For anyone who's interested, uh, it's right there in the chat. You're more than welcome to join. How do you keep avoiding the attacks, though? Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is, this is kind of shitty. 
bro's tanking everything. Like it, he he avoided two bounce. Come on. Uh, he. Yeah, psychic would be super effective, but I'm also a nice type. Do I outspeed him? I don't think I would. I, I don't think I'd outspeed him. My best bet is probably sending out Tito. Hopefully Tito can come in clutch. But you know. Let me heal you up before anything, right? Before before you you use that as an excuse to say um that, <laughs> that you know he he was already low health. He, he could have died at any moment. Your attack fell, your defense fell. Well, it is what it is. Uh You know, I'm not healing you a second time. I I did it already, Tito. Hopefully this kills him. Thank you. It did. No, no, no. It isn't Tico. It's Tito. T-I-T-O. Also Grimmsnarl 49. Let's go. Grimmsnarl Supremacy. Pokemon are simply marvelous. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, no. You, you didn't deserve that second heal, man. If, it, if it's true that you are the clutch Pokemon, then, you know, I have to test you. Use this item, Razor Reds, I can't have my boy, my, 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 my first Pokemon out here getting screwed up. Fun fact, actually, for anyone who's interested, um, Razor Reds was my first follower. I decided to actually check him out. Um, he does a lot of retro game stre um, streaming every so often. Uh, last I checked, actually, he was going through... He was doing, like, a, a playlist of games throughout the years. Um, he keeps going up a year every time he plays through a game. Last time I checked, he was on games from 1997. And, uh... Since then, I think he might be in the early 2000s from now. Actually, um, Jess, I can check that out for you. So give me a second. 11 or 9? Actually, I'll, I'll tell you right now. Right? So, so just so you know, right? This is this right here. Uh, a little closer on the camera. I have a little notebook that I drew up on. And it is my uh, Twitch follower notebook. Right? And it has the name and dates for every person who has followed or rated or done anything of the sort, right? So, you wanted to know, Jess, right, um, when yours was? You were actually number 10 on January 28th. So, you're not that far off. You said that, what, you were 9 or 11? You were actually in between both of those. Yeah, um, I like keeping tabs on those things, right? Because... I don't know, um, it's, it's very... Oh shit, Godfire, I haven't seen you in fucking forever, bro, how's it going? Actually, let, let me look you up too, right? Because I feel like... <laughs> Actually, um, Godfire was number eight. I don't have post... Uh, I don't... I don't know, um, how that works. Uh, I'm sorry about it. Um, Godfire is actually number eight on my list. He was on January 26. You've been busy. Oh, really? Um, so how's it been? Like, uh, you you were at school, right? So, um, if if I'm remembering correctly. So, um, what you been up to? Like, ha have you had a lot of tests, a lot of homework, or is it just more personal things? Uh, or if you know, if you don't want to answer, like, you don't have to, because I know that. 
there are some things people like to keep to themselves. Desert Eagle. Also, um, yeah, uh, <laughs> Desert Eagle is very good against a lot of Pokemon. You were moving at, when you were last year. Oh, okay, um, and how'd that go? Did you finish, uh, you know, the moving process, or are you still working on that? You know, or have you already moved, but you're, um, you're, you still have things to unpack? Because I, I know moving's, uh, a, a, kind of a bitch to handle sometimes like I, I know what it entails i used to move a lot when i was younger and you know it it, it it was very difficult um having to clean out the old place you know go through your shit have a bunch of memories and then having to fix everything over there and cleaning that place out having everything very habitable You've been busy, uh-huh. Oh, you finished! Actually, that's very- that's very pog. Um, congratulations, Godfire. Uh, I actually hope you enjoy your new place, right? Uh... It's... It, it, hopefully, um, it's not too much of a drastic change for you, cause... Unless, well, of course, that's what you want, right? Most streamers remember their first 25. Okay, so... Book right is because I'm very bad with names, uh, especially like even with people who I am very familiar with, people I talk to in in like in IRL. Um, sometimes it takes months for me to actually remember their full name, but I remember things about them. I'm a face person, that's the problem. So, what I do right is I just write down everyone's names here with the dates that they came in. And there's a little something about them that I always try and remember. That way, um, every time I take a look at the notebook or every time I see one of you, you know, um, it, it eventually ends up staying with me. Um, oh, you have a pool. That is very pog. So, uh, uh there, there's a lot of things you can do with a pool. <laughs> But, um, I'm gonna just keep it PG-13 for now, right? Uh, the basement, you don't have to hide bodies under your bed. Very, very good. Very good. You know, it's, it's, it's a hassle, right? Imagine having to hide corpses where you sleep, right? The smell, the decomposing, the flies. Oh, horrible, horrible. I wouldn't want that. <laughs> I only kill people if they hit me. <laughs> okay, but here's my question, right? How many of them do you incite to hit you? And when you say hit, does flirting also count? Because they're hitting on you? Cough, cough. It's hard to keep the bodies under the bed. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you have been following for 14 days. And Godfire for 15. <laughs> Okay, so it's nice to let you guys actually are are are, are on top of it. Yeah, no, God, <laughs> my two days. Hey, hey, hey! You guys don't have to fight. You don't have to fight. Okay. Um, Togedemaru is an electric type. Heli uh, Heliolisk. I don't remember what your typing is. I am going to assume that this punch is going to be enough to beat you. And drill pack. Well, it's going for mouse. I'm not attracted to anyone besides Zobi One. Very fair. Yeah, he, he, but is he pure electric or is he dual typing? Zing zap. Well, either way, Tito's probably dead. Yep. And a crit too, so that's kind of not very pog. Electricity only. Are you sure about that? Because I'm pretty sure fighting moves aren't super effective against electricity. Oh, my signature move, Desert <laughs> Eagle, to work on it. Well, good sir, actually, I. 
you want to use your 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 desert eagle i use ak-47 and that is a lot stronger okay um they're electric types so do i have any ground no i don't well steel's dead you know what? i'll just toss out jess he has what discharge like um lightning rod whatever also you're a dragon I wish I had a fairy right now, but uh, he used nuke. He is electric normal. Ah, okay, so then he did have a dual typing. Well, you lied to me then. You said he was just electricity. Why, why'd you do that? You hurt my feelings, man. Also, this charge. It hits everyone, even T-Pain. That is very sad. Does Boom hit him too? It does... Well, it is... You know what? We're, we're just gonna poison him. Hurricane is super effective because it's a flying type move. God damn it! <laughs> you thought it was electric cycle? Well, then you see, good sir, we, we're having problems here. Also, that's pretty decent damage for, uh, for poison jab, actually. Also, what stops the bad guys from shooting you? Okay, so... My co Okay, so what stops them is that I'm the main character in this game, right? I can't lose. Technically. Technically. Spirit Break is 75. This is... Or special attack. Now, you know what? Screw it. We're going this. My Vern is going down. We're gonna jab the goddamn rat. Like, they, even if they did shoot me, right? They, they, they have to be at a disadvantage somehow. Don't you dare. Okay, I was about to say, don't you dare hit, um... Jess. Jess, Jess can't lose this. I think the Jess Pokemon will be great in the band. Hmm, I'm not sure. I think he might be a rocker. There's something about him, right? It, you're just so pro. You're, you're, you're a man of many talents. Spirit break. I am definitely healing you, Jess. I don't want you to lose that XP. You definitely never <laughs> Actually, believe it or not, you, you've never killed me in battle. <laughs> have I? Have I not? Have I not? I, I, I'm, I'm honestly, I'm not sure if, um, if you really haven't fainted. Okay, so why don't you test it out with his desert eagle? You know, Godfire, you're very trigger happy. Makes me, makes me question a few things. Very trigger happy. You know, maybe instead of guns, may maybe maybe you can attack your enemy with their emotions, right? You physical damage heals, not emotional. Go 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 after what hurts them the most. Tell them their tims are fake. That'll make them cry. Maybe missiles. Razor Res? Ooh, shit. Level 50. Nice. Let's try and fat. I'm at a loss for words. I might actually need to... To do some emotional damage, but then again, a gun to the head will do it. I mean... <laughs> you're not wrong? But here, here's my argument. Why end your enemy when they could just suffer? Guy, come on. Emotional damage is very good if you know how to do it. It could be worse than death. By the way, if there's any Twitch mods out there. <laughs> Watching this, uh, we're, we're joking. We don't mean it seriously. Please don't be um, trigger happy on that ban button, please. 
But yeah, you know, emotional damage is the strongest type. Other than you saying you should kidnap them and torture them. I'm not gonna say no. I'm not gonna say no. I'm just gonna say it really depends on the type of, um... The type of torture you do. Right? Because there are people that, like, for example... I tie you up to a chair and I make you I force you to watch the entirety of the Teletubbies. I mean, I'm pretty sure you're gonna come out batshit crazy. You're probably gonna be the next Joker. Just start murdering everyone. It's like Oh babe. There's a little problem here. <laughs> uh I wanna destroy the world. Kinda bullshit, right? Emotional damage is not affecting his psychopaths. Actually, you would be wrong. You would be wrong. Because basically, you're just making them be better psychopaths. The more emotional damage you inflict on them, the, be the better of a psychopath they become. Because the thing about psychopaths is that they're so out of touch with their humanity that whatever little bit of humanity remains, they they try in some very weird way to maintain it, right? So take that away and well they pretty much fucking go even more bad shit lunatic than they already are. You're you're making more enemies more dangerous. Yes, but they're more they're <laughs> They're more of a danger to themselves. Remember that. They're more of a danger to themselves. If you make them mad, they will torture you. Then make it a competition. See who can who can who can torture people the best. Uh, you torture him, he tortures you. You both become even more fucking crazy every time you also start torturing each other. <laughs> like poking a tiger with a stick. Good sir, there are people, right, who who have tamed tigers, lions, cheetahs. Just letting you know, it's possible. Also, I'm not sure if I'm even going the right way. You hit their sensitive spots with a pipe iron. Uh, it's iron pipe, good sir. Oh yes, five star service. <laughs> yes, very, very, very good. I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to go. I I've been just so engrossed talking with you guys and and fucking around. <laughs> um, I I have no idea. Like, actually, let me check the map because I I feel like I'm being stupid right now. Uh. Okay, so Pokemon League HQ. So it's to the right. Okay, so I should be here, right? This is where I am at the moment. Uh you're typing this normal gun. A very a very good typing. Very good. They're probably a strip club in the Pokemon world. I'm worried about that. Right? Because it makes me question. It restores HP to poison type Pokemon and damages other types. It, it makes me question, right? If whether or not, like, certain adult themed things in their world would translate appropriately. Like, for example, a liquor stores, right? Like, this is a world where you have people putting their Pokemon to work at, at stores, right? So it's like, would your Pokemon... Would you have a Pokemon selling liquor? Like, how old does a Pokemon have to be to, to, to be working at these places? Do they even have, like, an age thing where it's like, you know, where um, in certain areas... Oh, if you're under the age of 16, you can't work, for example. So then 
uh does that apply to pokemon do pokemon have to be 16 years old do they have their own age variation you know there, there there's a lot going on there there will be weed and drugs no well, well that's a completely different story and well i am so out of it i never even realized this is how pathetic i am right now the fact that Rio Gage evolved <laughs> I have I, I I just saw it right now when it was healing, a Charmander as a drug. Actually, the way I see it, um, it's very probable that, for example, there would be drugs made from Pokemon like substance, um, substances, right? For example, I don't know you 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 start fucking whiffing in the the sweet scent of a Vio Bloom mixed in with other shit and suddenly it's like an addictive drug reach correct we've been watching over your performance in the gym challenge this is just a formality of course but i'll need to check your gym badges if you don't mind i'm all sorted and ready to battle you on the biggest stage of them all but it looks like bead couldn't make it hard luck somehow i didn't think he'd just take being disqualified lying down you know what i mean I guess it is what it is. Come on, Reach. We should head to the locker room. Okay, so this is actually a very good uh, question because I I've seen people talk about it, especially with, with, like, the anime. So, apparently, like, in the show, there are actual animals, especially in the earlier seasons. Um, I don't think they, they show them in newer shows, right? But they're definitely there. And why is there so many d dead kids in the forest? Um, are you talking about the... What's the name of this Pokemon? The the little tree? There There is bound to be a whole world of adult things that can't be accessed. Like houses you can't go in. Or buildings that are blocked. Actually, that that's true. Like, if you ever notice in, in a lot of these cities... Oh, hey, Marnie. How's it going? Uh, if you ever notice in all these cities, right, there there are, like, sometimes a few houses. Houses that steal stuff. I know that there's been a lot uh, between us, well, with my big brother, Team Yell helping, Spike Mew, and all that. But the truth is, when all said and done, I really want to become champion for myself. So don't take it personal when I kick your butt. Very cute, but screw you. Um, heck, Team Rocket is a literal mafia. Bro, like, actually, can, can we be on? Can, can we talk about like um Pokemon team enemy teams? Um, Team Rocket is yeah, you're right. Team Rocket is Mafia. Uh, what what is it? Uh, Team Team Plasma is technically speaking a cult, right? Also, yeah, this is easy. Uh, yeah, th team Pla team plasma is technically a, a cult. Team galactic is basically just a bun a bunch of that shit crazy um scientists. That's my first thing. That's strange. Just another Pokemon. Um, team magma and team aqua are kind of a little more on the on the i guess fanatic side right F uh fanaticism but they're, they're still kind of mafia ish then we have team skull which is literally a um a gang Yell is just a bunch of fanboys, so screw that. Uh, am, am I missing any teams? Flair. Team Flair. Um What what would Team Flair count as, right? Cause the whole thing is that they wanted um Xerneas and Eveltal to uh you know do their thing, right? Well, what was it? I I'm trying to remember the story of the game now. Uh, what did they want to resurrect something? I I, I really don't remember. Heck, there might be underground Pokemon trade that us. Oh 
Dr. Krog. Yeah. I mean, it technically technically is, right? Um the the best uh, uh option that I could like mention right now is um you could check this out, right? There are and I'm, I'm not trying to call anyone out. Um, have you seen other channels where they literally have it set up where it's like, oh, um, join here and you get free shinies or you get, uh, uh, whatever Pokemon you want kind of thing. Like, clearly, uh, well, I, 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 I could give them the benefit of the doubt. But most of these Pokemon are probably hacked into the game, right? So technically they are the black market. So they they, they do count. How, how do gym leaders get their Pokemon no matter what the Pokemon game's level? More Pico, more Pico. More Pico was also uh it's like no, dark, right? Yeah, it was the, the goddamn mouse. God damn it. So this should hopefully kill it. Actually, that is a lie. Gym leaders do level up. They do. Uh, Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald, the Versus Seeker, you could go in and fight, um, the gym leaders after a while and they would become a lot stronger. Oh, also, uh, Godfire, take care. I really appreciate you coming on by, man. It, 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 it was nice to see you again. Uh, hopefully, you know, everything goes well for you with, uh, uh, you know, whatever you have left on your moving. Although you said you were done, but you know, there, I'm pretty sure there's still a few things. Rock choosing this Pokemon, implying that they chose Pokemon based on badges because not all trainers start off in one place. So they might be over. I just came over to stop and say bye, insert meme of the wise imposter in the vent and replace the imposter with me. Also, hello! I did not know Grimstarl had a Giganta. Starfall. It is very dark. Would poison still be super effective against it? It is. But you know what? No, we're doing this. We're doing this. Fuck it. This is literally a ditto fight. And when I mean ditto, I mean like we're both using the same thing, not we're not that we're using dittos. Okay, wait, actually explain to me. Why does her Grimmsnarl have a... Have a Gigantamax? Also, how the hell did she one-shot me? Wait, wait, wait. What, what, why did... Why did hers have a Gigantamax? Do I need something for it? Do I have to like boost my levels? Because I, I know that there are Dynamax levels, right? So... I'm assuming that's it? You better be faster. Oh, you use a full restore, sure. You know what? Sure, why not? Just waste your turn.
Yo. I'm... <sighs> Someone please look that up. I am super curious. I really need to know how is it that, her that Grim Snarl doesn't began to max except hers. Get away, hey, we beat Marnie. I'm not super surprised. Okay, so I lost, but I got to see a lot of good points of you and your Pokemon. And 15k, baby. So what are you giving me? Everyone in the stadium was watching for me and my Pokemon. It was nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Guess that's not so bad. I think I'll join my brother in the stands and we'll watch from the sideline to see who ends up challenging the champion. Some are born like that and in the DLC you can feed your Pokemon something to make them be able to get Gantamax. Okay, so does every Pokemon have like a Gantamax form? Or is it just a select few? Because I definitely thought mine didn't have it. And then she proved me wrong. I'll be waiting for you in the final match. After seeing the way you battled, I can't accept any outcomes besides winning this match. My team is on fire. No, but I'm like super curious about that. Like, how does that work from a gameplay perspective? Pardon me? Only a select few. So then how do I know if mine is going to be able to do it? Is there like something that tells me? I know you didn't get a long break, but the match before is yours ended more quickly than expected. Challenger Hop won quite handily, so as soon as you're ready, we'd be back. Oh, we'd like you back on the pitch. But there, there has to be like something that lets you know, right? Because let me. Oh, it heals me. Okay, never mind then. Uh, where is it? There's a book in the DLC that tells you all po all the Pokemon that can. Give me a second. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I'm going to use it on that because I'm it's super weird. If it has a red X. What do you mean if it has a red X? Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean if it has a red X? How do I get the red X? What is that when you check summary? next to my name well the name of the pokemon well, i guess none of mine have it that's actually very depressing yeah none of them can have it uh, that's that's rough dynamax candies only level up strength of the pokemon that effect oh okay so I assumed it was so like if I had a high Dynamax level, the Pokemon who could Giganta would, but I guess not. Hey, yo, Hop, what's up? I just had this sort of flashback, you know, 
Remember back when we were still in Postwick? When we got our Pokemon firm lead that day. I would never dream that I'd end up standing here. Facing you of all people. But it's time I finished what I started that day. Got it? The one who will become the champion is me. It's nice that you can pump yourself up, kid. Damage by Hop. Oh boy. Double. You're screwed. You are screwed, man. If you trade it to me, you can feed it the food to get against the max it. So then, there is you, there is a way for you to affect it. Okay. Hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Zen head up. Perfect. That makes this a lot better. You learned a lot by studying these. Oh, it made me flinch. God damn it. Hit me, don't make me flinch. Hit me, don't make me flinch. Reversal, perfect. I like how he always has to call out the fact that he did a super effective move. Hit me with Zen. Do not make me flinch. Do not make me flinch. God damn it. Oh, be doing this. Isn't Zen Headbutt like a five power point move? Or is it more than that? What did the Dynamax Soup do again? Actually, I think the one who could probably tell you best is Anxiety because I, honest to God, haven't experimented too much with, um... Dynamax items. His defense fell. That's no, actually, my defense fell. Uh, my attack is also down, so I might have to use superpower again. I don't wanna, because I don't want it to. Okay, well, you did me a favor. You actually hit me. So that makes reversal stronger. Yes, perfect. Grim Snarl, level 50. Let's go. Corviknight, we are switching you out, good sir. With Razor Reds. Corviknight was, yeah, steel flying, so this should be perfectly fine. Uh, a nerve. Two nerve seat berries. That's fine. I don't need berries. Pyro Ball, hopefully this is a one-shot, one kill. And it is. Nice. Perfect. That is actually very good. Reds is 51. Tito hitting 50. Brave Bird. Very, very good attack to be giving our boy here. The... This also damages the user quite a lot. Mm, so basically, it's like a last a last resort. Uh, I haven't used Pluck in forever, so I'm going to just give it there. And let's, you know. Oh wait, anxiety. Was that for me? Was that message for me, or was that message for Jess? Because I, I you were, you were talking with Jess, so I'm not sure. Who, who was that for?
get her away. Um. Oh shit. Oh, it was for me. Um. Sure. I'm already like halfway through the leaf. Um. Well, I'm I'm doing a leaf four right now, technically. Uh. So. It would have to be when I'm out of this. Which, by the way, I think I might actually be getting my ass handed to me. Uh. He was using flying moves. He was using fighting moves, right? So Tito was actually a good choice. Grimstar on. Yeah, he'll feed. It's like yeah, yeah. I, I was I was seeing that. Uh. Oh. Doesn't affect me. Perfect. Uh. Sure. I uh, I'll. I don't mind. I, I I'm actually down for it, right? Because. I want to have Wong again to max on me, but um, that would literally have to be as soon as I finish Elite Four. Well, it's not even Elite Four technically, but you know what I mean. It's the the rivals. Justice fifty one. Hey yo. I pressed A a bit too quick. I'm gonna assume this is Monkey. Is it? Is it Monkey? Tell me it's Monkey. Come on. Come on, baby. Venturing. No, it's not. It's not. It's this piece of shit. Uh... You were bug, right? No. What? Hmm. <sighs> Wait. So then, what are you weak against? Oh, well, apparently nothing that I have. That is nice to know. Uh. Well, Pyro Ball it is. Also, um, je um, anxiety. I think what Jess meant is that he he's too broke to get the DLC. Ryokage is up level 50. Let's go. Rid of Loom. Yep, this is Monkey. We got this. You think he got me backed into a corner? No way. <laughs> Whoa. Yep, let's go. Uh. Yeah, you're. I know you're gonna do it. You're gonna do it. You're, you, don't bullshit me. I know you're gonna do it. So I'm gonna do it first. Yo, Bunny is angry. Let's go. Do it. I know you are. Yup, there we are. Release all the thoughts poured into my wishing star. Time for Dynamax. I knew. I just knew it, man. Like, come on. Everyone's fucking doing it. And the race can yeah. I mean, I, I know all the starters can get against max. I like but um I guess I just have it it, it is We got this one in the bag. Very easy. Compared to uh, Marnie, actually, I, I don't think I I had any feints here, did I? Anyway, Reach, thanks, mate. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. And 11k. Yo, I have had random NPCs pay me better than you. Um, And the victor of the semifinals, the challenger who has won their way through all the many hopeful trainers in the gym challenge is... None other than Challenger Reach. Ayo. You know, when even when Sony was saying that you and me look like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate. I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. So good of you, Reach. 
and grab block and the rest of your team. I appreciate it. But yeah, um, I, I know all the starters. I, I think the, all the starters can uh, get to max. I think um, Sobble's final form has like a sniper. I, I think I'm, I'm misremembering. But I remember there being a meme about it. That was incredible. Brilliant. Honestly, there were even tears rolling down my face before I knew it. To think that the two of you set out together from the same town, built up the greatest teams and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another. That burning desire to win. Those moves filled with undefeatable passion. It was battling at its very purest in every possible way. Even though we, there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenge at first, that was you, Lee. <laughs> then all the more reason. My team members and I will give everything that we've got in us in order to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might as well end up being you, Reach. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. That's right. The real challenge is what's coming next. And I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best to refill your energy source first. Why don't we go get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but you never care at all what food tastes like, Lee. A night like this deserves more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good. Calling your brother out, man. That's not fair. Oh, it's that place that we were at earlier. <laughs> Is it a restaurant? It looked like a hotel to me. Challenger Reach? Hey, Challenger Reach. Uh, got some time for questions? First question. You and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in... ...to have defeated your rival. Uh... <laughs> it was just luck that I won. If I say that, he'll feel offended. And if I say it doesn't feel quite real yet, uh, I'm glad I could be him. Question number two. If you wanted to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? Tell him how strong he was, that he was just a rival I knew he was. I thank him for the great match. Question three. Level with me, kiddo. You, Your honest thoughts here. Do you think you can win the finals too? I absolutely do. And you've been asking rather rude questions. We've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother, so sorry, but clear off already, would you? <laughs> well, Hop is kind of um, aggressive here, isn't he? Famous people sure have it rough, eh? I hope Lee gets here soon. I could eat my own arm about now. Several hours later? Bro, like, how long do you have to wait to actually eat? Holy shit. This is absurd. Even Lee's never this late. Something's not right. He always does what he says he'll do. As a kid, he promised me he'll become champion one day, and he went and did just that. He ought to be able to keep his own dinner plans. Kids sure got a mouth on him, huh? If you were ever that noisy during our battle... You'd unleash a whole new level of power, you know. Oh, pack it, Impiers. I'm seriously worried here. So I don't have to see your smug mug looking like you're having to go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. Judging by appearances, eh? No wonder you lost to your mate. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him headed to Rose Tower. Why would he go there? Well, I don't know what he's up to, but I ran into him at the monorail platform. He said to tell you he had something to do at Rose Tower, so he'd be late for your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to do there at this hour? Pierce, do us a favor. Take us to Rose Tower, will you? Neither Reach nor I know the way. What rude siblings always so demanding of others. Though I suppose it's a real problem for me too if the finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you little runs. You were good enough to beat me after all. So I think I'll invite Team Yo along and we'll have ourselves a bit of fun, shall we? You're the best, Piers. Let's go make a real ruckus. Did they heal me? 
Oh, they did. Perfect. Actually, whoa, 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 whoa. wait. You're 55. You know what? No, I'll just keep you there. You, you've been doing an actual great job, and I don't want to take that away from you. I wanted to switch you out for a second there with um, Mr. Mime, but hey, what's up? Hey, oh. Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from that battle with you, Reach. We decided that Team Yell will cheer you on, Reach, so let's help out together. Oh, let's head out together. Sorry, I'm just stupid. Uh, what a beautiful display of sibling love. However, it is entirely unnecessary. Miss Oliana. Chairman Rose is with the champion in a very, very important meeting. There is no way I will let anyone interfere. After all, only authorized personnel with the proper key can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. And that means that as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I've had a selected oh I have hand selected a member of the league staff and given them a key. Chairman Rose doesn't kind does enjoy these kind of menial games after all. Do you think you can tell the difference between normal league staff and the one I chose? Well that depends. He has six. There has to be a defining feature about him. Do you think you can find me? What should we do? This isn't good, but I got this one. Reach. Team Yells Yellen will handle this. No, this is brilliant. I'll search around the front of the stadium. For now, we should try and head to the plaza together, right? All right, let's all work hard to get. Uh, let's all work together and head for Rose Tower. Let's find Oliana's league staff member. The bad one was wearing those lame shades, right? We're crazy, uh-huh. Some league weren't even doing their job. Okay, so... You have glasses. Well, actually, you're, well, you have shades, but it's not the same tone. Your shades are also... Why are you hiding over here? This looks awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn around. Say something surprising so that we'll have no choice but to look his way. We already have the key, you know. Bless, I turn around and I can't escape. <laughs> I can't suffer before battle. That's him, right? Yeah, it, okay, yeah. Uh, Marco Cosmos, out Eric. Hey, yo, we got another dark type. Yo. <laughs> you're, you're not making it very far, buddy. Reversal should... No, you know what? I I'm not risking it. Let's see if we can nuke him. Super power, hopefully, is enough to one-shot. It is. Nice. Yelp is out. Who are you switching up to? Yo, I hardly got XP from that. Durant. Durant is steel, correct? Steel bug. So, Razor Reds should be enough to kill it. If I... Yup, it is steel bug. Perfect. My cheers <laughs> will really get you going. Uh, thanks. Gives me more speed. I mean, sure, why not, right? Because apparently my Pokemon isn't fast enough for uh, an ant made of steel. T-Pain is 56. That's very nice. How much are you paying me, good sir? Uh, 9k. You know what, it's fine. 9400 is pretty good. All I need to do is hide and I won't have to give you the key. It's a wonder how fast that guy could run. I have no idea where he went. So, it's not you, it's not you, it's not you. 
Is it you? Yeah, it is. How'd you find me or did you just talk to everyone you met? Whatever, I'll defeat you this time. Like, how many times am I going to fight this dude, right? Uh... I would assume... Mawwow. Okay, so... You're still a dark type. Wait, no, you're... You're also fairy, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Not no effect. Wait, 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 wait. No, wait. What steel? Yeah, no. You are steel, okay. Yeah, they, thank you. Thank you for um, giving me stat boosts. Not necessary, but very, you know, very grateful. Yes, 52, baby. Drill. Uh, X cut drill. That was a... I don't remember. I, I would assume that you were a uh, rock type. So I'm gonna switch out to T-Pain again. Hopefully that is enough to actually take it down a few notches. No, no, you're ground, right? Fuck. No, gr ground steel? I don't remember. Holy shit. Well, you definitely have steel moves, so th there's a steel type in there. Well, either way, super effective, so... <laughs> nice. I even switched up my Pokemon while I was running. 9400. You're gonna run away one more time. They say a tree can hide in the forest, so I thought I could hide myself in the crowd. Not very difficult to find them. You're way too observant, but I'll win this time and get my and make my getaway. I mean, it wasn't even that hard to see him. Um, there there wasn't even a, uh, anyone in there the first time we walked by, and he literally went to, into that corner. That was my that was my train of thought at least. Iron barbs. Okay, so I take damage. Pin missile. That shouldn't be doing much. Yeah. Yo, hardly anything. Like what? Two points? Yeah. Two points per hit. Yeah, you have my support. Okay, thank you. Uh, you're the best, Marnie. Let's hit you. You know what? Uh, you have what? Two? Nah. I'll, I'll stick to reversal for now. Because if it just so happens that your next Pokemon is also weak to fighting, I'll just try and one-shot it with uh, Superpower. What do you have here? Uh, Steelix. Okay, so definitely switching you out. I mean... There, there hasn't really been a need to... To like uh, uh, my game against this dude, like all his Pokemon have been either weak to fire or fighting. It's pathetic. And there, that's it. One shot. Oh, and it was a crit too. Nice. Are you gonna give me ninety four hundred again? Make it, make it, come on. 94. Look at that. Seems like you've got me cornered. But I'm not going to give up. An earful, an earful from Miss Oliana is way worse than anything you lot can do. Good luck catching me on the monorail. I mean, you told us where you're going, bro. Oh, 
Also, this is kind of annoying. Like, you're, you're surrounded by people. And somehow... You're gonna act like, um... You, you, like, there's no way to catch him. It's stupid. <laughs> Hi, Death. How's it going? Um... Who, who are you, mysterious stranger? I have never seen your name before. Oh, you did a cracking job of cornering that bad League member stuff. Um, let me sing you a song fitting of your rocking deeds. The only thing a humble singer can do is sing a humble song. Maybe I can't hear someone on just with the tunes I play. Maybe my songs don't make anyone happy. Maybe I can't help. But still, the only thing I can do is sing, sing my humble song. Pierce. Hey, isn't that Pierce? Why is he doing a street performance? I think you mean a station performance. Come on, let's see if we can get closer. Come on, people. You know you want to see him sing. Also, how's it going, Dev? What, what you been up to? We got the key piers. We can take the monorails to uh, Rose Tower now. Up, oh, now's your chance. Go and get out of here. Also, por si acaso, eh, yo abro lo vi ya mismo. Es que esto, este, me, me quedé aquí y no quiero dejarlo a mitad. So this is Rose Tower. Just how tall do you think it is? I can't even see the top up there in the clouds. So what should we do? Team Yellow is going to have their hands full holding up the bad league staff members. They won't be catching up anytime soon. So what should we do? Let's go on ahead, obviously. Let's go collect Lee and get out of here. Without him, there's no champion for you to challenge in the Champion Cup. Reach, you cleared the way to Rose Sour. Now all you gotta do is charge on ahead. An employee's an employee, I guess. Seems that exec lady hid the monorail key. To try and impress the chairman. Up inside. Wondering what he's plotting. Times like this, when tension and passion run high, remind me of Spike Muth in the old days. Some write wild con concerts uh, we had back then, but no encores. You're still here? You better get going. I'll send some support your way with a yell. Gotta stick around to make sure my bro doesn't do anything crazy, right? Come back if you need anything. Let's go. Um, I was planning on just doing Pokemon for about two hours, and I've gone around for just about what? Uh, actually two with 40. Uh, I'm gonna leave it here. <laughs> because, um, I'm assuming that after I beat, uh this part here i will go straight to the league and technically beat the story right so since i don't want to leave it like halfway uh what i'm gonna end up doing is just dropping it right here then uh, hopefully the next time we come back to pokemon sword and shield would be technically the last time uh we end up doing any story content because after that i'm assuming it would be end game Okay, so I'm just gonna end up saving here, and uh, I'm gonna open up a little tiny uh, Smash Lobby if there's anyone who's interested in joining. So, uh, I'm gonna be right back in just a minute. I really appreciate you guys waiting out, and if, yeah, uh, I'll be right back then. Sorry for the wait, guys. <laughs> 